Hi folks, this is KevBank1982 and welcome back to XCOM 2. So, in the last episode we sorted out our next lot of research, done the first proper mission. I say proper mission, we were forced into the uh, people who we were going to take. Um, and then we yeah, we started off the next research which is the modular weapons. I was just trying to remember where to go to try and hire soldiers. For yeah. most of our soldiers, the living quarters on board the Avenger are a step up from the conditions they've had to live with on the ground. See my commander's quarters. Is it the armory? Ah, recruit. Yep. So... I may come back and recruit some people. There's 25 supplies for each of them, so... Yep. We'll come back and recruit people. Let's get into the bridge. Just stay clear of the perimeter, understood? Commander. Good. I think we got something here. Despite all of Advent's efforts, there are still people who refuse to believe their lies. And it's time we let them know they're not alone. We've already located a target for our first operation. Sir, given our current location, there's actually no way the Sky Ranger could reach that position. Who said anything about the Sky Ranger? Shen, status report. Are we ready? Short answer, yes. But you might all want to hold on to something. This ain't good. Setting course for Sector 8, Mexico. So it's testing my computer at the moment. I think I need to lower down the settings a little bit more. We're ready to start making moves, Commander. By hitting Advent wherever we find them, we can help strengthen the resistance. In return, they'll contribute material and personnel to support our operations. So, so it's an easy one. We get an engineer, which are very important in XCOM 2. So we just need to destroy the alien relay. So let's get going. Commander, it looks like Shen prepped a med kit for us. We should equip one of our soldiers with it before they deploy. I'm gonna give it to Kelly. Um, who am I gonna take? We've got squaddies. Yeah, I think I'll take three squaddies and a rookie. So, let's get into it, really. Nothing else to do. Second proper mission. Try and skip anything that I can skip. Sky Ranger deployed. Which we've the seen squad before. is ready to deploy on your order, Commander. Let's go. Signal triangulation is locked in the location of a hidden alien communications relay uploading data to the advent network in this area. Disrupting the aliens' progress is our highest priority, so we're moving to destroy the relay before they complete the transfer. Terminate any hostile forces operating in the area. Secure the site and destroy that relay. So I'm doing other things in the background. I need to try and avoid doing that as well. Um, just have been doing other videos. And trying to encode them and then upload them, so 
that when I'm playing XCOM, I need to avoid doing that. So we went to Mexico and we ended up in Los Angeles. Okay. Sounds reasonable. <laughs> Not. Well, red light me. Red light. Age now. Menace one five. The communications relay is up ahead. Move in and destroy the target. We're in concealment. Got it. Moving. We've only got eight turns, so an aggressive Good first turn is needed. We've got a hostile squad here. Obviously, we're still concealed, so we're not too bad. And their vision range is fairly far back, so. Go, go, go! No need to ask twice. Again, I think I'm going to get into position so that they spot me rather than me on jumping out on them. Position confirmed. On the move. That's affirmative. So that I am. Um, it's just also that they can't shoot back at me in their turn. Overwatch. Affirmative. Covering now. Overwatch. Scanning. They didn't move. to help it along. Roger that. I think if you hold control, you can put waypoints down. Now. Okay. Just hoping that I can get them to spot me. Heading there now. Because I don't want to waste any more turns. Roger that. If they don't spot me the next turn, I've got to run in. What's that? Got it covered. Scanning. Got it covered. Come on, move. Nope, they're not going to move, so. I'm going to have to just take them out. I can just run in and I wouldn't they mind tricking it like this. <laughs> one shot, one kill. Kill confirmed. Advent forces on the ground. Oh, there's more over there. That might be a bad position that I'm in at the moment. Yada yada yada. Yeah. 
it's not a good position at the moment. Moving to position. Hopefully this is a flank. It is. And hopefully that will be a kill as well. Yep. Target down. So just need to move into best positions with the other guys. We go here. here Hopefully I can I might choose a grenade. Trying to a little bit up. Yeah, that'll do. It'll give us a good choice of either kill the other, kill the officer, or kill the other guy. Or try anyway. Obviously, there's no good cover. That's better than all. Yeah, so the, he's getting killed, hopefully. Not doing too bad at the moment. Ah, okay, he's running. We'll leave him to run. No problem with that. Covers a precious commodity at the moment. I'd realize it's not too far forward, so I can take a little bit more time. On the move. Obviously, I can't take too much time. But Moving on target location. Bit of time is good. Got it covered. No need to ask twice. The alien transmission is still active and we're running out of time. Get to the relay and take it out. ASAP. I do enjoy telling us things that we already know. I'm gonna go here. Headed there now. Hopefully it's a good position. Advent forces on the ground. Oh damn it. So we, we knew it was run. Oh, I might be able to get a flank on the sectoid. Hopefully, I can see him from here. Orders confirmed. Moving out. Please hit. Excellent. I'll take four damage. Shot, hopefully it'll kill. Yes, excellent. So just two enemies. Again. No good positions. I can't stand out in the open. Just run to here. Moving. Turn. Should be able to kill them in this next turn and then kill the relay. Miss, miss, miss. Oh, damn it. That was unfortunate. No, 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 no he's panicked no, no. as well. No. Don't! If you don't kill him, I'm going to scream. God damn it. Why would you run into a position like that when you're panicked? Hopefully. Oh, he's gonna get nice and close. He's gonna kill him, isn't he? What? What? 
Okay, crazy UI. No, not UI, AI. Crazy user interface. Right, I'm gonna save that one because I know that I can do the slash attack. So this guy is going to shoot at. get into a position where I can be flanked. But it would be nice to get a flank on the other person. Orders confirmed on the move. Throw a frag. Okay. 54, 54. So let's try and kill this guy. No, we missed. I'll get him next time. Over here. Right, let's kill this guy off. Moving to position. Eyes on the target. You gotta do something. Okay, so he's down. I might just grenade the other fella. Taken care of. Just make well, sure that he dies. That. Hey, we got a promotion as well. And we got laser sight, which will increase the critical hit chance of any weapon it's attached to. And we got a data pad, which contains vital data about advent strategy and communication. Our research team can crack them to gain intel, but it'll take some time. Okay. So, the last person to move. Hey guys, I is love this. This person. Moving to designated position. Throw a nice little grenade at the person. Take this. So he's gone. Mass explosion. The signal is fading. They've almost completed the transfer. This Alex is your moved. last chance to take out that relay. There's no problem on doing that. We've neutralized all the enemies, so in fact I think it's hundred percent chance to hit anyway. There you go. One hit, one kill. Or one shot, one kill. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Excellent. Again, another person wounded, so we may end up needing to get more people. Down most damage was Jane Kelly, made most attacks was James Carpenter, most under fire was Kowalski, and we fear this was Carpenter. A new record on our shot, successful shot percentage, but then the other ones we were better than the previous mission. Hope we get a good, um, a good unit. From the, um, the squad, the rookie that we had. Excellent work, Commander. Your efforts in the field have certainly encouraged the crew. So, medical protocol. The gremlin will read the combat. Maybe. Send the gremlin to an enemy to jolt them, dealing guaranteed damage, which is increased against the robotic enemies. The medical protocol. The gremlin can perform, perform healing actions remotely. Gremlin heal and gremlin stabilize. The gremlin has a single charge. If medikit is equipped, Gremlin will gain additional charge. So I'm gonna go down that way, I think. Yep. Then our squaddy. We either get attacking it. Oh no, that one. Blade Master. Deal two extra damage on all sorts of attacks, or when squad is revealed, this soldier remains concealed. So. Mm, Hard, really. I'm thinking we're going to go for Blade Master with this guy. The next one, that, or this girl, I should say. The next one we get will pick up Phantom. And let's see what he what we get. It's Specialist, Command your Gremlin to move. Yeah, blah blah blah. 
We've done that one. So let's continue. So we've laid the site, data pad, sectoid corpse times two, trooper corpse and officer corpse. Which is excellent. Our troops covered one of the Advent data pads from the field and there is valuable intel stored within. We can recover the intel but it will require some time. Okay. Now that we've got some help, we can start clearing out the old equipment and debris from the ship to make room for new facilities. Okay, so we got Jonas Beckers. We can yeah, get some debris cleared out. So basically these are our rooms. We used to excavate on the XCOM 1. We now have to get rid of to the clear out these debris. rooms. First, we'll need to assign an engineer to the task. Once we start getting into the far reaches of the ship, it's going to take more time and manpower to make space for new facilities. So as you can see, when we clear it out, we get some supplies, which is excellent. Looks good to me. Just give the word and we'll get started, Commander. Excavation is underway, Commander, but it's going to take some time to get all that stuff cleared out. Yeah, so it's five days. Commander, we have a secure transmission coming through. Source unknown. Patching it through to your quarters. So, let's get up there to the living quarters. Oh, the Commander's quarters even. Hello, Commander. The council you once knew is no more. Its membership have all sworn loyalty to the Advent Administration. With one exception. It is good to see you again. In the days since your capture, I have done all I can to aid the Resistance from the inside. It was these Resistance operatives that provided the intel leading to your recent extraction. As of now, Resistance forces are currently somewhat disorganized. If we are to defeat Advent and their alien masters, you must change this before it is too late. What you are seeing are classified reports of missing civilians from across the world. Their numbers are growing. We suspect they have been taken to a nearby Advent black site, though its exact location remains unknown. Time is short, Commander. We need you to take charge of resistance operations throughout the world. Establish contact with the local cells and bring them into the fold. Find this black site and shut it down. Save our world. The clock is ticking. Good luck, Commander. Looks like we better get started, Commander. I'll be on the bridge when you're ready. Okay, so what's the bridge? Commander, our current position is here, just outside Resistance Headquarters. When we're not on the move, this will serve as our home and our source of supplies. The Councilman has tracked the alien black site to this region. Unfortunately, we don't have its exact coordinates yet. If we're going to have any chance of finding this facility, we'll need to make contact with the local resistance cell nearby. Tygen has a theory about how we might reach out to them without getting the alien's attention, but we'll need to give him time to conduct his research. We shouldn't wait too long on that, Commander. We have to start making contact with other regions soon if we're going to build a global resistance and take on Advent. New objective added. So, make contact with local resistance in the Black Site region in order to gain access to the Advent facility. Research resistance communications, fly to the Black Site region, make contact. Looks like you won't have time for that just yet, though. Remote reconnaissance may have found something not far from our current position. Commander, after our recent success, members of the resistance in New Mexico have brought us reports of activity that we may have to investigate. So, time to investigate six days and we get some rookies. Avengers get over there. new course. Commander, while we're waiting for new missions or the completion of our research, we can pass time by scanning at sites like this one. On your order, we'll start our scans of the surrounding area. Okay, so let's get going. not think I could have predicted this outcome, though it is intriguing. Excellent, so I can get me weapon upgrades now. 
new research. We can get magnetic weapons. Find the research in the advert modular weapons has allowed us to reverse engineer their system for our own use. Any weapon upgrades found in the field can now be attached directly to our soldiers' weapons to provide tactical bonuses. So, we've got two important ones. The one that lasts three days, one that I think I'll go for this one. We'll get back to the I other one. I assumed you'd make that research a priority, Commander. I'll notify you as soon as the report is available. Although I had realistic expectations as to the limited resources and facilities available to me on board the Avenger, I have to say, it's taken some getting used to. Even with the ship's dampening field, frequent turbulence and the occasional evasive maneuver make it difficult to conduct experiments of any notable sensitivity. I may have to adapt my research techniques to maintain efficiency under these conditions. He loves to talk, so let's go back to up here, and we'll carry this on. So, we've um, cleared the room, got 34 supplies, and now we can build something. So, we can build whatever we want to build. We've got 6 out of 12 power, so we don't need the power relay just yet. See, once the AWC is built, that's the Advanced Warfare Center, soldiers may gain a bonus ability outside of their current class whenever they are promoted. In addition, an engineer can be staffed in the AWC to decrease the time our soldiers need to recover from injuries. We can get the Guerrilla Tactics School. The Guerrilla Tactics School will unlock additional skills and benefits for our soldiers, including an increase in the number of soldiers we can take on a single mission. It's 14 days. Quite a few long builds. I think I'm going to build the Advanced Warfare Center. We'll start work on the new facility right away, Commander. I'll send word when it's up and running. Okay. So we could use him to um, to do that. I think for now, I might just unstaff him for now. There's okay. room for us to expand our facilities on board the Avenger, Commander, but we'll need more engineers to clear out space for construction first. Wow, well, how long will this one take? Oh, you need two. Okay. So if we do this one. This one's going to take five days, and what I might do is just finish off the search for rookies. Oops. And then end the episode because it's coming up to 30 minutes. Okay. So many of the buildings in this area are still intact, so we broadcast the wide, wide area signal in the hopes of contacting possible survivors. A small group of people cautiously emerged from an old warehouse and expressed interest in joining the resistance. So we've got William Green, Shasa, Mawak, whatever, and then myself. So I added myself to the game and then we've just got me. So we click OK. So awaiting orders, waiting orders and awaiting orders. So next up is in fact yeah we might as well go to um setting course for the Mexican regional tract. And I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to end the episode here and then I'll continue from this point next time. So if you like the episode, remember to like, subscribe, comment, etc. And I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.